Piano Annie here with Inside Tweet. I'm going to show it to you two different ways and here's what it sounds like. Okay, hopefully you heard a little bit of Pine Top Smith in there. And here is the same idea, but this time with octaves and the tweet, which is G, A flat, A, will be inside an octave frame. And here's what that sounds like. Okay, so basically what I wanted to show you was this idea of just doing a frame of some sort. And then on the second strike in the left hand, if you use my left hand method of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, then the little tweet just comes in on two. And then there's just three more of the frames to fill it out. So the whole thing is just like this. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, and then when I was in F uh, for the first example, I used this for my F portion. Just I flatted the E and I used the same tweet. So it was one, two, three, four, five. And when I climbed up to the G for the one bar of G, it was Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. So by finding the third note of the G scale, I, that's where I started the little tweet. Okay, and then when I went down to F for the one bar of F, I did F up here with an A and an F, and then the third note of the scale, and I made that the tweet. And just remember when you come up for that extra uh, sixth frame to flat the B, okay, because we're in F. So it was. And then for a transition note, I just hit that um, sixth and then back to the C. And other than that, let's see, I, I, I did the, when I, I did a climb in between the C portion and the G portion. So it went like this. Okay. And I also, I forgot to mention that between the G portion and the one bar of F portion I used, I just climbed down using that sixth there. Uh, also, when I did those original uh, bars in C, instead of just doing the same thing four times, I, and, uh, I added a pine top smith. And I have a whole video on pine top smith if you're not familiar with it, but it went like this. Uh, I'll show you the pickup notes in a second, but the Pine Top Smith part went. Okay. Now, there was one other fancy thing I was doing in there, which was sometimes in between, because I'm only hogging up five strikes, one, two, three, four, five, I'm left with six, seven, eight. So I added three pickup notes and you don't have to do that. It was just a little extra flourish in there. You could do two pickup notes, one pickup note, no pickup notes. But what I chose to use was one. I used that as my first pickup note, a little smash of A, G, F. 
okay? And then I went down to the D and up to the E flat. So it was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I went into Pine Top Smith one time. And then when I was done with the C section and I was going into the F, I used it as a pickup to go into the F chord, which was. And the weird thing here is that this is the bottom note in the F chord. So what I did was I switched from my pointer to my thumb. And then I ended up with that sixth. Okay, so those are all the parts put together. I'll play it for you one more time uh, now that you know how it works. and I forgot to tell you about the ending. So for the ending, I just finished. And then I just hit, and I climbed up to the G, and then I just landed on a C7. I'm not the greatest at endings, but there you go. There's something you can use. Okay, so for the second option, which was with the octaves, let's see how I did that. That was just C octave and the same tweet and then the same pattern. So it was one, two, three, four, five. And I didn't really do too much with the six, seven, eight this time. I think a couple times I might have hit G, A, G, or A, G, A. You could do whatever you want there. Uh, basically, then I just climbed up to the F section. So when I finished with C, I just let the beats go by. And then I used one bar to climb up. So I just did octaves again, C, D, E flat, E. And then I went to the F section, find the fifth note, and make that your tweet. So it was like this. And then to get back, I usually would hit E flat and D. And then it's back to C. And when I was done with the C portion and it was time to go to G, I went into an immediate climb up. I just did D, E flat, E, F, F flat, and then... I'm sorry, G flat, and then to G, finding the fifth note, this became the tweet, so it was, and then a transition note to get me to the F bar, and then I just used the E flat octave and the D to get back to the C, and then to end it, I just went up to D. And then I did the tweet in octaves. And then I just went to the convenient C7 that was right here. And I probably just mimicked the notes in my left hand. So it was like. All right, so let me play that for you one more time. That one's a little simpler. inside tweet two ways you can you know, throw in just little pieces of it in your own improvisations and if you have any questions let me know and I'll see you next time <laughs>